Welcome back to DIY with Dave. In this video, I'm gonna be building some bike racks to store my bikes. Now I do most of my DIYing from my garage here and I have a decent space. There's quite a bit of space in here, but I do have to share it. I've got a bunch of garden tools, I've got a bunch of bikes and a bunch of other junk that, that kind of takes up space. Now I'm trying to find ways to organize this a little bit better so that I have more space, I can do bigger projects. And I'm really doing that in two phases. The first is I'm getting rid of a bunch of junk that I just don't need. I'm selling some things on Craigslist, I'm throwing some things out. Um, but I'm also finding places to store the junk that I do have and trying to make my organization more efficient and better so that I have more room to do projects. And that's where this project comes in. Now, in order to build these bike racks, I've, I need some wood, and uh, I happen to have these old drawer fronts. They're not much to look at, but they are hardwood, it's a red oak, and uh, these I pulled out of my kitchen when I remodeled it. I even actually used the cabinets in my kitchen and put them here in the garage for extra storage. So I'm gonna be using these drawer fronts. I'm gonna cut them up, and um, I thought this would be a perfect project to use these up. I actually have used them before. I built some, uh, some uh, frames out of some of these before. And so it's actually been, it's good wood. It's, it's a hard wood and I like to reuse things. So here we go.
In order to attach the racks to the cinder block wall, I need to first drill a pilot hole with a masonry drill bit and then use a masonry screw. When drilling into concrete or cinder block, you need to use a powerful drill like this quartered impact driver. Small battery power drills just are not strong enough to get through the concrete. 